everybody, this is Steve at Hot Dog Profits. Today we're going to be talking about money handling. When you're out working a gig, when you're doing your daily, uh, daily location, how do you handle your cash? Several different methods, we're going to cover them all. Uh, today we're going to start off with uh, working from a money roll, just working from cash. Um, we went out to the bank this morning and we got $100 and uh, we got a roll of quarters. We got about 40 bucks in ones and the rest in fives. And that's enough money to get you through a normal gig or a normal day. If you're doing something huge like a fair, you know, giant festival or something, you're probably going to need more than that. But we start out with 100 bucks. Um, a roll of quarters is 10 bucks. And then, like I said, 40 ones and the rest in fives. You can work from a cash apron. A three pocket apron works well. I used to use that, but now I just uh, I like to use my pockets. So I'll take my paper money, I fold it in half, and I just put it in my left pocket. And the quarters, I'll break open the roll, and I put them in my right pocket, and that's where I work from. So why don't you come on in close? We're going to zoom in here, and I'll show you exactly how to do. Uh, the actual exchanging of money at your hot dog cart. Okay, customer approaches the cart and they buy a hot dog. We say that'll be two dollars and fifty cents and they hand us a twenty. First thing we do is place the twenty on the table and I put a mustard bottle on top of it. We don't use ketchup, right? Put the mustard bottle on there for two reasons. Number one, so that it doesn't blow away and number two we want that money to stay there until we've counted all of our change back because we don't want the customer saying, hey, I gave you uh, a 50 or a 100. So we leave that there and the hot dog was 250, so I'll reach into my pocket with the quarters. I'll count back 50 cents, so I say that makes three. Then I reach into my other pocket where my money roll is. And I'll show you this close up. We open it up, we've got our small denominations and our large denominations so the small ones always go on the top so we've got 50 cents makes three then we say four five and then I put those in my pinky like so and then we work from the back and we say 10 15 and 20 and hand it back to the customer so we'll show you that one more time. This is a great way to count change back because you don't have to do math. You don't have to sit there in your head and say 20 minus 250 is 1750. You don't even have to do that. You just say 3, 4, 5, 10, 15, and 20. There you go. And they pick up the change and off they go. So that's working from a money roll. And I think that it's a great idea for you to practice this a couple times before you get out there. We always put our 20 on the bottom again. Or if we start getting too much money, uh, we can take some of those bills off, put them in our back pocket, just get them out of the way. And that's working from a money roll.